hello guys welcome back to another video in this react series as you can see here we have a simple responsive form which will fit according to the screen resolution either it might be a mobile screen or desktop it will auto fit based on that screen resolution in this video we will learn to add this responsive form in react.js application by using one of the popular css framework that is bootstrap First step to add simple bootstrap form in react.js application is we need to have a bootstrap framework installed in our react.js application. If you don't have already bootstrap in your application, please watch one of my video in which I have explained the steps to add bootstrap along with an example. I have provided the link for that video in the description as well. To get started, let's open the code editor. Here I have created a separate functional component for this example and I have a basic structure of functional component here. I have added a react fragment here. Within this one we are going to add react bootstrap form. First within this component let's create a bootstrap container div to hold our form. Next within this container div let's add a form element. This is the main form element that wraps the forms input fields and submit button. Inside this form, let's add three input fields for collecting user data that is name, email and age. Now you can see there are three input fields. One is name and this is the block for this name. And similarly we have block of input field for this email and age as well. Here you can see class name mb3-3. This is a bootstrap class which is used to add spacing between each form elements here. Then here we have defined HTML4 and assigned it to name. So this is a label element which is associated with the input element. The label displays name and it is linked to name of this input field with ID by same name here. Then this is the input field of the type text with the class form control. So this is a bootstrap class which we are using for this input element. Similarly, we have two more fields email and age and for this email we have used the type of email which will have some basic HTML validations here and for age we have defined the type of number which will accept only numbers in this field and the final step is we need to add a button for this one for that one let me add one button JSX element and this will be of the type submit. So whenever we click on this button form will get submitted but in this example as we are not adding any action to this form this application will reload here only. Once this is done let's save the file and go back to browser. Now you can see a bootstrap form with three fields which we have added here and you can observe this is responsive as well. So this is a simple bootstrap or responsive form which can be integrated into a larger React application to collect user information. Based on different scenarios or requirements, more fields can be added or this form can be customized. In the next videos, we'll add some more features to this form and customize this one. And we'll add some validations as well for this form. So that's it guys for this short video. Let me know your questions or feedbacks in the video comments. Thanks for watching this. If you like this video, please click on like button, share it with others and subscribe to my channel.